off, Tails. I got to stop your folks before they do something stupid. No! I'm through listening to you! Look, I'm sorry your dad got locked up. I really am, but... I'm sure your heart bleeds. <laughs> You're not talking your way out of this one. You're making it real hard for me to hold back, bud. I can understand wanting to help your family, but I'm not cool with you attacking me. Tough! You've had this coming for a long time! Me? What did I ever do to you? That's my point exactly! I have no clue because you don't care! I'm sick and tired of it! Of what? What's the point of explaining it to you? You never listen! <clears throat> I thought you were the one not listening anymore! Stop trying to be witty! All I have to do is keep you pinned down here so my parents can finish what they started! If you won't pull any punches, then neither will I! <gasps> I'm taking this outside! Get back here! See? This is how it always is! Sonic the big hero runs away and leaves me in the dust! Okay, so I left you behind on a lot of missions. You were too young for most of them. I didn't want you to get hurt. That's what I used to believe. But then I factored in all the times you teased me and made fun of me and never believed me when I talked about my own adventures. Dude, I tease everybody. It's what I do. I don't need to hurt anybody's feelings. Except maybe Shadow or Eggman. But even still, you don't see Antoine attacking me. You would have let my dad run in prison. He tried to oust the king. You can't just give Elias the boots. He's trying to save the city, and you won't give him a chance. He wasn't even in jail for a day. You didn't give me a chance to do anything. The great Sonic the Hedgehog wasn't quick enough? Dude, you're taking everything I've done to help you, and you're skewing it. Don't you hook up with Fiona to help me? Wait, is she what this is all about? Don't say it like that. You knew I loved her, and you went out with her. I don't care. Oh, Fiona, I knew it was a robot. I don't care if she ended up choosing skirts over me. You knew I loved her, and you went out with her anyway. I thought you were my friend. I thought you were my brother. But everything I care about, you take away from me. Okay, Tails. If that's what you think, go to town on me. You, you're trying to trick me. Nope. I'm totally honest here. I know Fiona meant the world to you, and I also knew that she had no interest in you. I was hoping if we hooked up, you'd move on. I didn't want you hurt, but it was selfish of me, I guess. I was still hurting from breaking things off with Sally. Fiona was there. I went with it. Like, I go with everything else. I, I just do. I've been a jerk to you, man. I didn't mean it. But it doesn't change the fact that I was. I am truly sorry I hurt you, little bro. Do you really mean that? I'm not the lying type. Besides, I don't want you hurting me anymore. You're kind of pretty good at the whole butt-kicking thing. <laughs> Thanks. Knuckles taught me a thing or two before he left. I'll bet. But next time you need to say something to me, stop angsting it up like Shadow. <laughs> no fair. Let me go. All right, then. Are we cool? I think so. I want to talk about things more, but... <laughs> We got to stop your dad or the king from getting hurt. We at least have to see what's happening. See, it's all right.